Welcome to my channel. My name is Tan. If you're new, in today's video, we have a unit that was sent over from Icon Beauty Supply. Today's unit is from the brand Outre. If I'm thinking correctly, it's one of their older units. It's from their Perfect Hairline Collection, and I got her in the style Dominica and in the color number two. If you want to find out my thoughts and opinions on this unit, continue to watch. But of course, before we get into the video, make sure you're subscribed and also make sure you follow me on Instagram and TikTok. They're both at Tan Dotson. Okay. Let's get into this insult. <laughs> Are you really gonna leave me outside? Got your phone 20 minutes past 12. Ring, ring, no reply. Don't see you much around here. Overdose on us on here. Drinking NFC since 17. We got fucked up over here. Say you don't listen to Green Day, but it's 21 guns around here. Yeah, do you I drive? Yeah, my little pony, she ride me. Always invited, baby, you always invited. So I'm stopping the video right here because this unit is not big head friendly like at all. I'm going to try to cut out the combs in this unit to see if that would possibly help it a little bit. And then also um, I'm going back and forth on whether I want my black stocking cap on top or if I want this stocking cap on top. On top. On top. <laughs> Excuse me. I wish that the nudish colored stocking cap was more to my skin tone. I don't want to put any foundation on it though because then the foundation gets on my hair and don't get me wrong, my braids do need to be redone but I'm going to stick it out about a day or two or three more and then I'm going to wash my hair. But anyways, I feel like it looks better with the nude cap on top but you can see the nude cap like the line of demarcation if that even makes sense but let's get back to the install <laughs> Okay, so let's talk about Miss Dominica from Outre. The cap construction is your typical cap construction. It has three combs in total, one in the back, the other two in the very front, the adjustable straps, the security band, and then the 13 by six parting space. According to the stock card, this unit is said to have ear-to-ear -ear soft HD transparent lace, natural baby hairs, comes with pre-attached elastic band, pre-plugged hairline and is also heat styling friendly. Now I pretty much agree with everything that's said on the stock card. The 13 by 6 frontal space, yes, yes, and yes. This parting space is incredible. I love a 13 by 6. Don't get me wrong. I love a good 13 by 4, but a 13 by 6 just does it for me. As for the HD transparent lace, I would agree with that as well. I mean, it is your typical perfect hairline collection lace, so yeah just make sure to put some of your bronzer or face powder whichever you choose to use or some type of lace tint to help blend it into your skin a little bit more I mean if you just wear it how it is it's gonna be seen I mean it's lace it's gonna be seen regardless but you know what I mean just make sure you add something up there as for the natural baby hairs I'm not the biggest fan of baby hairs but if I am going to utilize them then I'm going to make them probably pretty messy and pretty fluffy because I don't know that just gives off a more natural look in my opinion and I did go ahead and utilize these baby hairs of course it's not too much or I don't feel like it's too much it could be a little bit less I don't know but I feel like it's cute and I feel like it works for the unit with the heat styling friendly, according to the stock card, it says that it can take up to 400 degrees 
Fahrenheit worth of heat but I only put my hot comb on about 310 and I feel like it took the heat pretty well now the pre-plucked hairline let's talk about it I agree with the stock card I really do agree with the stock card but I want to talk about the sides of it for some reason I feel like most outray units the pre-plucked portion that they're talking about is pretty much right in the center when it comes to the sides I feel like the sides are very rarely or either never actually plucked i tried to plug this unit on the sides and i was having so much troubles where i was just like no i'm not gonna do it i'm not gonna do it right now mm -mm. maybe when i take off the unit but then again i'm just like am i gonna wear this unit up probably not so yeah and if i do wear it up it's gonna be with a headband or something like this so I agree with the pre-plugged portion because it's very much so pre-plugged in the center but on the sides it's a no-go. The texture of this unit seems to be about a yakky texture and as far as the density goes she's thick but she's not overly thick or rather she's thick not overly thick but lightweight if that even makes sense. <laughs> as cute as this unit is I would not recommend wearing her during the hotter months because I feel like you are going to sweat even though I said she's lightweight she's lightweight as far as the feel on her head again I wouldn't wear this during the hotter months unless I'm gonna be inside and that's a different story but as far as outside mm -mm, ain't gonna happen the length of this unit I would say would be about 26 to 28 inches when it's all pulled to the front she does stop about right underneath my boobs but once I push her all the way to my back she stops I want to say about mid back now as far as tangling and shedding goes be prepared for this unit to tangle on you and I'm talking about tangle tangle but I feel like that's pretty obvious and a given seeing as how curly she is speaking of the curls if they do get a little messed up I personally just use my little handy dandy water bottle because that's what I had sitting right here I know a lot of people sometimes will use mousse to bring the curls back but like I said I had the water bottle right here and it worked just fine just make sure to kind of like scrunch the unit as well and I don't know I feel like that kind of helps tame them but also brings them back to life now I can't lie to you guys when I was in the process of installing this unit I was pretty sure that I wasn't going to like her as much as I wanted this unit I was thinking like oh my god I'm gonna end up hating this unit for the simple fact that she wasn't big head friendly initially like the curls kept tangling up I couldn't decide on which style I wanted to do for a second I was like oh my gosh this is too much hair but in the end, I actually ended up liking her. And I don't know if I'm going to leave these clips in or not. I'm, yeah, 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 I'm going to leave them in. Um, I couldn't decide on which style I wanted to do. And when I say that, I was like, okay, do I want to do a half up, half down? Do I want to do a flip over method? Do I want to do a middle part with two little ponytails or something like that? Ultimately, I ended up landing on just the bust down middle part which I'm actually surprised about because a couple of videos back I was talking about how middle parts do not look good on me but I actually like this I don't know maybe it's because it's a lot of hair though and I feel like I have a big face a round face I don't know and maybe big hair fits around face I don't know but anyways I really ended up liking the middle part this unit does come in an array of colors and I'll make sure to pop it up somewhere here on the screen initially I was gonna get the Havana brown color I don't know I just felt like that was gonna give me brave the girl from brave the Disney movie I know y'all know what I'm talking about but then I was just like no I want something that's everyday wearable so I decided to go with the color too and I'm not mad about me going with the color too because I feel like she turned out very pretty lastly let's go ahead and talk about the price of this unit on iconbeautysupply.com she does retail for $44.99 but if you plan on picking up one of the specialty colors expect to pay about a $2 upcharge so yeah those are my overall thoughts and opinions on this unit if you plan on picking her up just be prepared and be ready to you know put in some work when it comes to her but then again it could have been me I could have made it more difficult than what it needed to be I don't know anyways if you enjoyed the video please give me a big thumbs up also make sure you subscribe before you leave and also make sure you click the bell that way you're notified anytime that I upload a video follow me on Instagram and TikTok they're both at tan Dodson I'll be sure to leave a direct link to this unit in the description box below so make sure you check that out I don't have anything else to say though except for I will see you guys in the next one bye